Hi guys, welcome to TLV Talks. My name is Satya Kam and today I'm going to share with you a few breathing techniques that I've used over the years. Now, as you all know, breathing techniques have three major benefits. Number one is physical well-being. Now I grew up with asthma and as people with chronic asthma know, it is not easy to breathe freely all the time. So with breath work, you get more oxygen in the blood and it gets to all parts of the body, right? And you feel more energetic and more strong. Number two is mental well-being. Now I practice meditation every single day. Now before meditation, breath work was the way that I used to get centered in my body. And it really started to calm my nerves down, reduce my stress levels, and I had more mental faculties available to be more efficient, to work longer, um, and have a, you know, feel stronger as well. Number three is spiritual well-being. Now, as you all know, we get often connected with what's happening in the external world all around us, instead of focusing what we want and how we want to live our lives. That said, now let's get started. For breath work, you need to have your posture right. So erect spine with feet firmly on the floor. Please don't treat this as medical advice. If you have a medical condition, please check with your health professional before moving forward. So before we get started, let's bring attention to our body. So watch your breath going in from your nose to your belly and then back up, back out to your nostrils. And as you breathe in, watch your belly rise and fall. So here we go. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Now let's try to introduce a pause between inhaling and exhaling. That will slow your body down further. Inhale. Pause. Exhale. Inhale. Pause. Exhale. Inhale. Pause. Exhale. So now that you are centered in your body, make sure you're sitting straight, so your posture straight, it acts fine. So now let's get started. One I want to share is one where you breathe into your belly, then you breathe in some more air to your chest, and then you release all together. So breathe in through your nose, into your belly, then again breathe, keep breathing in air into your chest. And what happens is you will raise your shoulder and then you drop. So let me demonstrate. Breathe in through your belly, some more to your chest, and then exhale. Breathe in through your belly, some more to your chest, and then exhale. Breathe in through your belly, some more to your chest, and then exhale. Now, a variation of this is to breathe in through your mouth and then also breathe out through your mouth. So like this. It's almost like you're releasing a lot of stress and maybe memories. So it actually feels great. Now just be careful, you might feel lightheaded. So let's move to the next one, which is really breathing through your nostrils. And this is one of the pranayam techniques that I've learned. And the first one we'll try is to breathe in through one nostril and exhale through that. We'll try five times, switch to the other nostril and try five times. Okay, so here we go. Now keep your hand on your belly. Close your left nostril and breathe through your right. And then breathe out through your right as well. Inhale, then exhale. Inhale, then exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. 
Now switch to the other nostril. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Now one thing which I realized while practicing this is one of your nostrils will actually breathe in more air and you'll feel better while the other one is a little bit more restricted. So let's practice. Now let's move to a different pranayam technique, a breathing technique called uh, Nadi Shodhana. So that's basically alternate breathing through your nostril. So you breathe in through one nostril and exhale through the other one and then breathe in again through the other one and exhale through this one. So inhale through left, exhale to your right, then inhale back to your, your right, and then exhale to your left. So the way to close your um, nostrils are with your thumb and your pinky finger. So you can inhale like this, and exhale. Inhale, exhale. So let me demonstrate that now. Again, keep your hand next to your belly so that you can watch it as and fall. Inhale slowly, exhale slowly. Then what we'll do also is introduce a pause. Okay, so here we go. Inhale through the right nostril. Pause, exhale through the left nostril. Inhale through the left nostril. Pause, exhale through the right nostril. Inhale through the right nostril. So again, let's try this. What this does is it it sends more oxygen to the um, brain and hence your brain opens up a little bit more and you have sort of more clarity and with more regular practice, it, you actually start to feel a lot better. Each technique may be practiced up to a maximum of three minutes or less. I hope you've liked this journey with me. If you've liked the video and content, please subscribe and like and see you next time. Thank you.